Hi, this is the Comic Herbalist and today we're at the last day of the vigil at Hogwood Farm and we've come down to get a last insight on what's going on. Would you like to introduce yourself? Oh, hello. Um, my name's Lisa Clark uh, and I've come here today to the Hogwood Horror Farm having seen the terrible footage of how these poor pigs are living online, um, living in this place, having to endure this suffering. So we need, we've come here to try and do something about it today. Yeah, I'm Kylo Sullivan. Um, pretty much exactly the same as what she's just said there. There's uh, killing an animal, but there's obviously torturing animals and just, just, just evil, man, just evil. So, yeah, we're here to shut this one down and then many more after that, mate, so. In an ideal world, all, all slaughterhouses would be shut down, but, 100%. you know, one step at a time, this, yeah. places like this, it, it's, and the majority of them are actually like this behind the scenes, just yeah. people don't realise, they think they're all happy-go-lucky play. No, they're not. Animals suffer horrendously, and this place, there's 15,000 pigs crammed into a small place there. It's, uh, for, it's, it's built for 400 pigs. And there's 15,000. 15, but as um, yeah, so same as that, man. It's uh, we want them all shut down. Not 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 because they're being mistreated. You can't kill an animal humanely. Simple as that. But the reason we're focusing on this one is because we have evidence of the abuse for one, which is allows us to sort of push to shut it down and whatnot and show people. Um, but yeah, we want them all shut down. All shut down. There's no way of killing something nicely or. Right. And that makes no difference if it's organic, etc. Et <laughs> nah. that's, that's a myth. It's not, it's not saying your heroin's organic. Yeah, it's all <laughs> it's, bad. It, it's bullshit, mate. It's bullshit. The fact mm. is, that animal has lived to die, man. It's that, mm. And that's the other thing that pisses me off when people say, sorry for the swearing as well, man, but uh, it's when people say, oh, but they, all they don't die, they're killed, they're murdered. They're, they're, they're not one of the animals you eat is, is died. None of them died, they're murdered, they're, they're killed. Mm -hmm. That is one of the, that's the first thing you were taught as a child. Not to kill, not to kill, and then you get a, a, a plate of death. So this, yeah. this is crazy, man. It's crazy, man. But it's changing. And it needs to stop. <laughs> Wake changing, up, people. It Meat is murder, and it's not good for you. It's killing everyone and everything. Do it. <laughs> it's so much easier than you think. There is so much available now there, and there's so many of us who are willing to help you along the way. 100%. Get in touch with your local vegan group, get online on Facebook, there's so much help out there, but the supermarkets are all waking up now, they're selling so much stuff. And it's cheaper to live that way, I mean, fresh healthy food is so much cheaper than eating really bad for flesh. your meat. Flesh. And, and the thing mm. is as well, the flesh they're eating, is, 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 it's been dead for weeks, it's man. It's antibiotics. It's, 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 it is, it's just full of shit. They put, they, they spray the packaging with carbon, carbon mm. dioxide to keep it. And if you are going to carry on eating meat, then at least have the decency to take yourself off, get that animal, dispatch it yourself, and then see how happy you are to eat it. Then and take your children along yeah. with you while you do it, and you might have a change of heart. But now there's, there's, you know what? There's, I've spoke to people who tried veganism 20 years ago, and they, they say it was too difficult. There's no excuses now, man. There's no, no it's excuses. Not. With the social media out there, the amount of activists, and you know what? The vegan community is the most friendly community ever whether you're eating meat or you're vegetarian or this that and the other they will help anyone yeah. as much as they want to help themselves and mm. the other thing is as well vegans don't do it for themselves they don't do it for profit they do it for everyone everything in the earth man so like when people say no oh, they push the views we, we, we get we get nothing out of this we if anything we take on shit we take on depression we take on bad feelings sadness and just all of these all of these bad feelings because you know, this is what we're supposed to do. To we want a better world 100%. for everybody. 100%, man. For me, most de what turned me vegan, it wasn't, because obviously, I, I was having this conversation with Kath. Before I met her, I had no vegan interaction. I go, so, like, we live in a vegan world now, because we, we, we all interact, all my Instagram, everything is just full of vegans, so it's all accessible. When you're not vegan, you don't interact, you see nothing. Mm -hmm. So you, you don't exist, but for me, the things that changed me was Gary Urofsky's greatest speech ever, and then documentaries like Cowspiracy, What the Hell. Earthlings, watch Earthlings. Earthlings. <laughs> them things there, man. It's like the thing with them there is, I can't answer back. If you have a debate with someone, you can give them this stupid, I'm a caveman, I'm this, that, and the other, well, 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 that's all that. If you've got a documentary showing you the shit that happens, man, you can't answer back, and you have to sit there and take it in, and that's what I did. <laughs> and it changed, it changed, I went and vegan at, overnight, man. At the very least, <laughs> what changed me was look, seeing the dairy industry for what actually happens to milk cows, to dairy cows. Yep. It's horrendous. If yep. anybody can watch the life of a dairy cow and think it's acceptable, 
to still drink milk and eat dairy, there's something seriously wrong with them. Uh, and they're all babies. They're, they're, they're they're the babies. thing Because they think a cow's up here and there's mm. X amount of pounds in that, they're all babies. The, 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 the dairy cows get slaughtered at five years old. Imagine working your ass off till five years old and being killed. Continually <laughs> pregnant. It's crazy, man. It's mm. crazy. They're, but they're children, aren't they? They're babies, man. Yeah. They're, they think because it's a big cow, it's, it's, it's mm. a mother. They're not mothers, they're still babies. Mm. They're children having children, having their children taken off them. Mm crying for days and when they can't stand no more they put a knife in their neck there's nothing humane or normal no, or, 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 or it's or, not a by it, it's not a byproduct product of anything it's just a life of slavery circle of death mm. circle of death man Sorry. if you could sum up this place one word what would what, what, what how would you use? <laughs> <laughs> jinx one two three four five five how man how how and the devil owns that shit man yeah the devil owns that shit man